historically, it's believed that only four people were there with General Wolf when he died. I think most people now understand to a much larger degree that it is basically a fabricated retelling of the story for a great effect. It was a painting that was done by Benjamin West, who actually kind of turned the art historical world upside down. If an artist wanted to um, depict a, uh, an event, um, basically the way to do that was to make allusions to classical history. So one, Benjamin West was making reference to recent events, but also he didn't clothe anything in terms of historical garb, but rather used outfits that were exactly contemporaneous to the event. As a marker of Canadian history, the Plains of Abraham was basically the battle for Quebec between the British and the French, and Montcalm led the French army and General Wolfe led the British army. You'll notice if you look to the left of the painting, you'll see a messenger coming in. That messenger is quite large. That messenger is coming with the news of the French having been defeated. Wolfe is dying happily because his campaign was a success. The painting that has been recently acquired is a smaller version. It's the same idea people use nowadays of buying posters or prints. It's an accessible way of having art. I need to submit a treatment proposal. What I think it needs to get it ready for, in this case, displayed beside our Death of Wolf painting. When West's painting was exhibited at first in 1771 at the Royal Academy in London, it was very popular. It took off from there, uh, a third copy a fourth copy. The ROMs version is the fifth large version. It would become a piece of propaganda to reinforce the idea of, yes, British imperialism is the right way to go. For the British people, that was very important. Our painting is in extremely stable condition. Museums tend to strive for very safe environments. By safe environments, I mean ref reducing the possibility of physical damage through analysis of our painting and through comparative research with the conservation records of other paintings we'll be able to help pinpoint exactly stylistically what he did as well as palette. I think West Death of General Wolf painting is really interesting for Canadians today because it does have so many meanings for different people. It may be something that people don't really want to dwell on, but I think because of its history, both art historically and in terms of how it's been used as a marker of Canadian history, that it has such richness. Mm -hmm.